Angel, uh, I, I like. Uh, what the? Oh, sorry, I'll move my bike. I. Junior? Hey, Angel. Are, are you going to Emerald High now? Yeah, actually, I just enrolled. That's awesome. So I'm assuming one of your parents got a job here. Y yeah, my mom got a better position offer at West Emerald Hospital. That's awesome. I'm so proud of Aunt Jenny. She's doing so good in the medical career. I bet my mom is going to be so excited. And even my dad is going to be so excited to learn that Uncle Carter and Aunt Jenny are in town. I bet. They all three got together a lot when my dad and your mom graduated. My dad even lived with them for a while. <laughs> yeah. I wanted to say hi. Also, is your bike okay? Or did you choose to leave it in the middle of the street? I, uh, that was a choice. Um, I'll move it. <laughs> Sorry that it was in your way. But hey, we got to see each other. Well, I'm gonna get going home. See you around. <laughs> see ya. Actually, I thought it was room. You can pull around, right? Because I, I don't really feel like starting up my bike just to turn it back off. Um, hey, Dean. Um, I, never mind. Um, I'll tell you another time. Are you sure you can tell me? I want to know what's on your mind. Uh, how about we, uh, you come over and we do homework together, okay? Sure. I'd love that. I might get donuts too. I'm not sure. I know I need to grab coffee first though. Um Axel, um Good afternoon. On a little coffee run? How did you just a hunch. May I ask why you haven't asked Dean out yet? What are you talking about? Also, that's none of your business. Oh, but it is. I want you to be mine. So, I need to know why someone wouldn't ask out someone that they may like. I was hoping it's because you don't actually like him. Well, you're wrong, okay? And it's none of your business. Come on, please. Axel, Angel, get behind me. Oh, Prince Charming comes in to save the day. Walk away now. Oh, hush now. You really do have a short temper, don't you? Angel's well-being means everything. So back off. Fine, fine. But I'll warn you. She will be mine. Okay, I need to head home. Are you gonna be okay? I don't wanna be alone. I'm too nervous with everything going on. Please stay here. But your parents would kill me if they- They don't have to find out. I understand if you can't though. I won't, I won't push it too much, but I don't know. I guess I just thought that it might take away some of my anxiety over it. I'll leave, and then I want you to open the garage for me to come back. I'll sneak upstairs when your parents go to sleep, and I'll sleep on the floor. I mean, 
mean, you don't have to sleep on the floor if you don't want to. You can just sleep in bed with me. I... I really? <clears throat> I mean, if that makes you feel safer, uh, then I'm willing to make that sacrifice. <clears throat> <laughs> Sounds good. Thank you so much. This means a lot to me. I'm sorry if this causes any debacle with your parents. I'll get Charlie to cover for you and say you were spending the night at his house. Thank you. <laughs>